Hey, what's up everyone? Free Darkness here, looking to help you all with another flight school lesson, as it seems many have trouble with this, so I hope I can guide you through it. So of course, the objective is to stay low to the ground, but you only really have to collect the points from a low elevation. So, as you can see, I can go through a bridge which can be hazardous to most. You don't have to do that. You can fly over it and then dip down to collect the point. The river is curved in such a way that, the, for the most part, just counting on your rudders to turn your jet is enough. And if you find yourself losing control, holding both rudders down can help stabilize your jet. If you gain elevation at any point, don't panic. Just focus on what's ahead. I find knife edges work great when taking steep turns, and it also works rather well when dipping in on the point before the dam. I find the higher up camera as well as the distance it stands from the jet makes it very difficult for me to distinguish the distance between objects and my own jet. So I would recommend cockpit view. You lose sight of your jet, so you must remain very aware of the wingspan and tail, but I feel it allows me a much more detailed and closer look to the environment around me, enabling me to maintain a greater sense of proximity, which in turn keeps me from having a nasty impact. This point at the bottom of the pipes I often have trouble with as traffic and a higher elevated point stand by, so you have to be extra careful with this one. This jet is very capable, so don't be afraid to dive after those points if need be. When taking hard turns, be aware your wings may collide with any small objects, and try to keep yourself nice and stable throughout. When you're flying at an extreme sensitivity, even minor impacts can have no effects so long as you maintain your control for a true pilot exceeds under pressure. Thanks for watching everyone, and if you have any tips of your own, feel free to share them in the comments below.